run out. Hey guys, welcome back to Ever Reviews, and today I'm going to be doing a full review of this nice, beautiful statue of Lord Beerus. Okay, also known as, um, um, God, the God, uh, actually, the, uh, what is it, the God of Destruction, okay? So you can see there's a very nice little statue here, okay? So before I forget anything, I'm just going to show you how tall he is. So I'm always dropping. From his base up, to about, um... Okay, he's about 12.5 inches in height. Okay, so he is um, but without the base, if you were to measure it, he's about he's about uh, 11 no 10 to 11 inches in height. So he's a very little tall, long tall size. Okay, so so it's very simple to put them together. That should have. So what you do is, um, you have this little piece, the front part, you got this, this piece right here, you can see, <clears throat> thing that, there's a little insert right there, you stick the, this little piece right here into there, and there you go. And the way you will put on his, um, his thumb, I'm going to say his little energy ball, is there's a little hole right there where you stick his, his finger right. That's where you stick that on his finger. You see, we have to give it a nice push, okay? So, um, I think it kind of a little tough, but there you go. You have to stick it in there. I won't recommend it in any kind of way. Just stick it in there. So I have to fight with it, okay? And <clears throat> of course, it comes out, and you see the little two uh, peg thingies. That's where you put his foot at, right there. And of course, you can see, also says that's where exactly how you put it, with him facing this way. Simply just two holes right there. You just stick it onto there. You have to give it some force. Okay. This is exactly how it will look. Okay. Damn it. Okay, so you can see that's how he looks. Okay, so now I'm gonna give you a close detail of Lord Beers. It's like I don't know what kind of cat he looks like we got, but you can see up close big old ears he has. Okay. You can see a little earring he has right there too, as well. Okay. So those scary looking yellow eyes and that little smile he has. See his, <clears throat> his outfit, the guy destruction outfit, the diamond in the middle. You can see his ring around the neck, gold ring. You can see the gold braces. Okay. You can see that. You know, he's very skinny. You can see his ribs are showing too. Okay. You can see that. You can see the back of him. <clears throat> Let's see. Look at that. Nice little gold um, platings and braces. His tail can move as well. You can see that. So I just want to do it too often because it's a statue. But it's pretty long too. You can see it, it can move too. So you can adjust the tail, the back of them. You can see those nice blue pants. Okay, you can see the front of him, just like you saw his outfit in Dragon Ball Super. You can see um, little diamond thingies right there. His little, uh, I don't know what you call this thing, little tacit. This nice um, little uh, waistband. Okay, you see that finger, the guy destruction finger. Okay. So you can see everything. 
You know, close is what the base looks like. It says Dragon Ball. Let's say uh, Dragon Dragon Ball for life. That's what it says. So if you're a Dragon Ball Z fan, you are or a Dragon Ball Super fan, whatever. Well, you are a Dragon Ball fan for life. Okay, I am as well. All right. <clears throat> so this is the full view of Lord Beerus. Okay, and it's a pretty uh, cool statue. Okay. I am going to get Wiz, so I just want to let you all know that. So as usual, I click the like button, subscribe, click the notification button, and leave a comment down below. Is a beer is your favorite Dragon Ball Super character, okay? And thanks for watching.